Defending AFSA Premiership champions Kaiser Chiefs aim to continue their impressive league form this season against a Blumpeting Celtic outfit that aim to keep marching up the top eight. It's at the FNB Stadium, a home that has become a serious fortress for Kaiser Chiefs, the most impressive of the AFSA Premiership sides when it comes to home form. Lovely uh, evening for a game of football, but the lights have been a bit of a factor. You can see then there is a bit of a break in those lights where they don't go all the way around this venue as they would usually do. Here's the outswinger. Again, whipped in, driven in towards that far post. Free header. Should have done much better then. The uh, man from Botswana, three goals he's caught this season. Could very well have been number four. Here's... Well... Sheeps with the opportunity! Click, click, bang! Nicely done! And it's Bernard Parker in the moments leading off to the half-time break that winds it up here and gives Patrick Dinyem absolutely no chance from point-black range. And by the way, double figures it is for him for the season in after Premiership football. Osana, nice take, but used his hand illegally. Had that been allowed to play on, Parker was in a great position on the other side, just waiting for the ball to be rolled into his path. Kaiser Chiefs on the up and up. Gata. Gata. Oh, it's looking good from Chiefs. Lovely turn. Great chance. Defenders did enough. Creative from Kaiser Chiefs. They carved that Limpertin Celtic defense open. Denied timelessly by Musa Bilankulu. These are the ones and twos. Buchanan, what are you doing? So, one hour football just about come and gone here at the FNB Stadium. Kaiser Chiefs still cruising through that uh, Bernard Parker goal. A well taken goal after Ngate tried the acrobatics, didn't quite come off. But you just felt for Parker who slammed it into the back of the net and in the face of Shabalala here. So, set piece for Kaiser Chiefs. That's a full hand on the face, then. Now, here's Nyatama, lovely angle on the pass. Now Celtic in behind that defense! Oh, it's come off the other side of the ball! Cracker that would have been! Charles still for Celtic! Numbers back in defense. A reminder for Kaiser Chiefs that one goal may very well not be enough. There was no way Itu could have caught that one. No way. And with that wide to Mohorosi, now the ball in by Buchanan, and the header comes in! Itu Malankuna again, going one way, has to adjust. Aguinha swallows it, punches it up. Masala looking for it. Drifts by one. Oh, it's a stunner! Absolute stunner from Nanesh Masala. Tinyan beaten hands down. Kaiser Chiefs with two quality goals. One from Parker, another from Masala. And that's the two-goal cushion. Some will be saying game set and match is sixth of the season. Early ball forward, good movement off the ball, yeah, great understanding. Gatla, Shabalala, set up for Parker! Superb save. Patrick Tinyem at his very best. It is Bennett Parker, denied by Tinyem. No! Oh, on goal! When it's not your day, it's just not your day. That's the case for Patrick Tignan, but for Kaiser Chiefs, three past Celtic. Cherry on top is a dagger to the heart from one of their own. Celtic with the chance. Oh, Mukarose should have pulled one back then. You know when they talk about Unkarasitsepal, it means I've been waiting for far too long. That's what happened with the, the coach, Ange Merindok. End of it all here in the Sancho Premiership fixtures. Kaiser Chiefs 3, Blumfontein Celtic 0. No.